And sometimes the lies are dressing themselves in truth. For an example, if you hear some bad news, something horrible that happened, and you don't know how to deal with it, so many of the people, for them it's very easy to say, Oh, it's all Hashem, all for the good, probably something uh, spiritual, it's tikkunim, Hashem is making things in heaven, and maybe it's true. But if you don't feel it, and you just say it because you want to avoid your bad thoughts, or your fears, or your lack of confidence in Hashem, or the questions that you have, the doubts that you have. So by saying, it's all for the good, it's all for the good, you're basically lying to yourself. And that's not the worst thing. Because you can also lie to someone else and to tell him, no, it's all for the good, it's for sure. And the truth is that you're lying to him. I'm not saying that it's not all for the good. I'm just saying that you don't believe in that while you're saying it. So don't say it. And then you go and tell it to someone else that he himself also can't believe it. It's also too hard for him to believe that it's all for the good. He now wants to feel his sorrow, his pain. He feels the loss. And now you tell him it's all for the good and he thinks to himself, oh, maybe something is wrong with me. Everyone believes that it's all for the good. And I'm the only crazy one that can't see that it's all good. So maybe, maybe I don't have no connection with Hashem. Maybe I'm far. Maybe I'm not worthy. Maybe I'm not Hasid. Maybe I cannot see. Hashem is blocking my eyes. And the truth is that you and Him are holding in the same level. But you actually rejected Him from that place because you lied to Him. It's written that Hashem Barach is telling us in the Torah that it's not right to praise Him, to thank Him only with our lips. Just it needs to come from the heart. In their mouths they honored me, but their heart is still very far away from me. It's just a temporary world that in this world, in this period of time, we have a mission. What's the mission? The mission is only not to forget the Creator, to remember that it's all Him, never to fall in the trap of all of those coverings, of all of those husks.